Hey guys, it's Heather from Cal of a Plan, and today I'm planning in my classic happy planner for the week of November 18th through the 24th. And this week I did something a little bit different. I probably should have showed you guys, but I didn't like, um, so I was doing this planner and it had like a bunch of leaves over here and I had a girl standing over here and it had this green color and I didn't really like that. And so what I did was I cut out some paper, but I didn't have this week in another planner like with these dates so what I did was I took two pages from another planner and I cut off the date and I just taped this down so this is actually the dates from the actual pages and then this is covering up the pages and I did the same thing over here so if you like were to look closely you would be able to see where there's a line but most people won't be able to notice that so you know my secret but nobody else does so I'm gonna move my planner out of the way I'm super excited about today's spread because I'm going to be doing something a little bit different I'm going to be doing um a pumpkin fall floral spread is what I have in mind so I'm going to start um I'm going to line these up so that they're touching and then what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to place these stickers so that they are overlapping directly across the two pages because I want this to be going up the spine. And this one can go like that. Then I'm going to go this. And by the way, these pumpkins were taken from the Happy Year sticker book. Then I'm going to go to the Fun Florals sticker book. And I am going to take some florals. And I'm going to do the same thing. with some floral stickers. And I'm trying to stick to like this peachy color in the florals. just because I think they look fall, fallish. Add in, let's see here. Mm, I think that sticker's too big, but I can maybe place it over here in this corner. Okay, so now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna grab my, whoops, my X-Acto knife, and I am going to cut straight down in between these pages. I need to cut this one. Okay, look! Now they're gonna be lined up perfectly. Okay, so then I can trim off the top and the bottom. And then I can trim off the top and the bottom there and I'll have to repunch these pages but I just love that they line up perfectly I could have done like 
where I put this down and trim it and put the extra over there, but they may not have lined up perfectly, but now they line up perfectly and I'm kind of obsessed. Okay, so now I still have a couple of these stickers from where I had to trim it. So I could take this, place it over there like that. To kind of frame in that note section. Okay. And then I could take these pumpkins over here. I don't really like that these are connected. So we can put a pumpkin like that. And then this other pumpkin. I wonder if there's actually like Cut off the edge. Let it be kind of like that. Oh my gosh. Okay, that looks really cute. So I'm going to put the floral sticker book away. And basically now I want to see if I can find any box stickers that kind of match. So like this stripe sticker could go here. And I have two of this Happy Year sticker book. So I'm gonna pull out the other one and see if there are, if I still have that stripe sticker. I do. So I could put it over here creating balance that's that's one reason that I sometimes buy two of the sticker books is because some some of the stickers you only get one of but I like to have that balanced look um so I like being able to place them on both pages so then I can put that checklist is not wanting to cooperate Put that there. There's like something on the back of this paper. Okay, and then I really like this sticker, but I don't really want the leaves on it. I just like the words. So I'm going to trim it down. So I trimmed it down. And I'm going to layer it on top of those stripes over there. Let's see here. I like this sticker. Although I wish it didn't have the pumpkin on it. I know the pumpkin matches, but I kind of like that the pumpkins are just in the middle, but that's okay. Okay, we can put a to-do sticker like that. And like, I like this one that says all the fall vibes, but again, I'm trying to decide if I want to put the more pumpkins. I think it's cute. So we put that one there. It might even be cute to put a floral over there with it to kind of tie in the floral aspect okay 
So I am going to pull out this fun florals again, even though I thought I was done with it. And just put that over there like that. Okay, where is my fall sticker book? Let's see if there are this says hello November, which I know that we're like halfway through November, but I like that this color ties in to this color over here. So I'm going to put that there. That's from the fall sticker book. I'm looking in the fall book now just to see if there's anything else. This says hello today. Could maybe put that right here. Do some layering. This says today, but I don't really like that it's angled on both sides. So I'm gonna cut that and then Peel that off and then over here maybe instead of having this to do sticker take that off and put this same sticker but in green over here to create that balance Then we can use some of these icon stickers. Okay, that looks cute. This would have been cute for um, a Thanksgiving spread too. I've been killing this fall book, that is for sure. Let's see. Let's see if there's any of these things I wanna put in. Here, I like this box sticker, but I don't necessarily like that the pumpkin doesn't match. So I'll probably put something there to cover that up. So are there any pumpkins? That pumpkin matches. Okay, I think I'm going to leave it like this. I think it looks cute. And I had a lot of fun making it. The next thing I need to do is I need to get my Happy Planner Punch and line these up. And then re-punch it. So that I can go back in my planner. And we're going to do the same thing with this one. Now that's re-punched. 
got to pull some of the stickers off. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's pull out the planner. And put these pages back in here. Y'all, that is so cute. I love how this lines up. I just love it. I think it's really cute. So if you like this video, I hope you hit the like button. If you want to see more of my videos, hit that subscribe button and happy planning.